Hi everyone, it's Az here from Heel vs. Babyface, joined <laughs> by the angel herself, who <laughs> will smite my demon, <laughs> which rages within after seeing this absolute king yeah. trash. Jane, how you doing? Good, good. Mm. I survived. Mm. <laughs> but did you really? <laughs> Did I have just to a little bit die a inside little, of you? A little bit, yeah, yeah. I'm a little <sighs> sad. I don't like what they did here. No, no, it was shit. <laughs> it was I, so look, good. show media was show media, right? Yeah. But I watched, I watched this 30 minutes of fucking trash. And I'm just like, I mean, I know that they had the first four episodes. Yeah. And trust me, this show ain't going to get any better. And no. holy shit, is there some stuff in this episode just like Yeah. Yeah. Um, but my god, this was dog shit. It was so bad. It was <sighs> the character, the story, the jokes. What jokes? Exactly. Exactly. Is a joke going, ha, I'm better than you? Yeah. That's Haha, they're bad. Men suck. Yeah. Um, I've just displayed that I'm better than you at everything. Yeah. I don't need That's you. What is he even in this? Um, because th he's the... I mean, he's not in it anymore, by the way. <laughs> that, that's it. It's that was Mark it. Ruffalo. Yes. Oh my god. That's, so uh, that's all his contribution to this series. No. Um, it's he was there to try and be an original name. Well, not technically, not technically, not an original because 2008's Incredible Hulk is canon. Um, but he was there as a, a big name to pull the people into the show. Mm, bait and switch. But they just make fun of him and degrade him the entire time. Yes. So I don't. I, oh. It's Do you know again. why? It's that because again. because the people that write things like this, them fucking tapped. Yeah, they are tapped with their penis envy. I'm just going to keep saying penis envy from here on in because that's mm -hmm. what it is. Fuck saying feminism, intersectional feminism, third wave yeah. feminism, fourth wave feminism. I don't care. These bitches that do this, <laughs> they are just dripping with penis envy. Yeah, it, it really Holy is. Cow. Yeah. Oh. The obsession. I mean, that's the only way you can really describe the obsession with it because every single scene is anti male. Yes. I, I, even just, I thought they would stop off. after the first 10 minutes and just no. move along, but no. 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 <laughs> once uh, we'll get, don't, don't worry, folks, we will go bit by bit. But once <laughs> it was established that she could control Jen. Yeah. At will, mm -hmm. then it was just everything was just stab, 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 yeah, stab. I don't need you, yeah. Admission from Hulk that she doesn't, she doesn't, need he's him. jealous of her. Why? Um. I don't fucking know. And there's no... Th the other thing, too, with this is that there's no transformation. It's... It, they deconstructed even the character herself. Because before, like, in the comics, she is a little bit more shy. She's more reserved as herself. As her human self. The whole transformation turns her into someone who's more outgoing. More, more like the Hulk in the show. But if you don't let her be vulnerable first, what's the point? There's no conflict. There's no, there's no, she's just empty. She's just a jerk. Oh, this show's gonna be very empty, Jane. I mean, it's just, it's so, oh, I just hate when they do stuff like this. It's okay. Do you want to break it down very quickly? <laughs> this yeah. is a fucking Karen, yeah, a white fucking <laughs> bitchy woman that turns into a green Karen. Yeah. There's no personality change. No. There's no there's no boosting of emotion or this, that, or the other. No. This is just I'm gonna let you 
right? Good say I fail, right? Yeah. And I'm going to turn to Green Monster, punch one thing, and then I'm going to turn back to camera and start fucking bitching about it. Immediately. Immediately. <sighs> so there's no growth. We we will see no development. We will see nothing with her. It's just, she's herself Ooh. just green. How do you grow when the first bit of the, the whole series is it's starting after she's been the Hulk. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And she's just kind of like turns to the camera and goes, oh yeah, by the way, uh, I'm the Hulk. Uh, my best friend knows. And she just basically says, there's no plot. Right. It, there you go. It, in the introduction. Did you know that Jessica Gao, who wrote this, who wrote Pickle Rick at Rick and Morty, which is, I love Pickle Rick. Episode. What? She oh. said that the uh, by the way the abomination isn't in this first episode. She said that the uh, the abomination trial was meant to span multiple episodes, mm-hmm. but they didn't know anything about it to write about it. Yeah, I I saw that. And hey. you can t- you can tell you can tell in just yeah, how they structure the courtroom scenes. Too. There's a thing called research. There's a, a a thing called bringing in people who yeah. do advisors, experts, actual lawyers. I don't know. No, they didn't do that at all here. <laughs> That's no. clear from the first scene. <laughs> Jesus Christ! They didn't even bring a fucking female expert in that actually knows how to female. Oh, they didn't. Uh, we brought this uh this this expert on. They're going. They're going to be how to be a woman without being an obnoxious <laughs> feminist white Karen cow. They don't want oh, that. No. We we we, no. we don't need that. No, no, no we don't want. Shh, can't have that. No, you can. You can. <laughs> Should we get into it. Oh. Trust me, I do not want to get into this. <laughs> for At least it and was then, a. It was a very short episode. They're all this episode, they're all this length. It's all 30 minutes long. Oh, it's explains so much to you. That's the whole series, 30 minutes long. And by the way, I don't know if there's something in the post credits at all. There Neither is. do I is there? I don't know. Because <laughs> as soon as that fucking first credit hit, I was out of there. <laughs> I was out of there. Yeah. There's a post credit scene. <laughs> you you can tell me. Like when we get to that point, you can just tell me because I ain't fucking watching this fucking <laughs> bullshit. So it starts off with Jennifer in human form. Yeah. Look at uh giving her closing argument speech, which mm-hmm. in these shows lasts of course 30 seconds. Right. Uh to her paralegal work colleague and a white male lawyer. Yeah. Who's co-counsel on the case? <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> Supposedly, yeah. <laughs> he's, 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 he's just there to insult her for no reason. Yeah, he exa- <laughs> exactly. He's literally there to just insult her so she can be a twat. Yes. <laughs> because they want to just be an immediate twat towards men. Right. But they thought, hmm. It's probably better because all we do this episode is whinge about men. Yeah. It's probably better if we have a little bit of setup. As in, he said a thing. He's like, I still think I'm the best person to close. Yeah. So that automatically makes him Hitler. Right. Because how <laughs> dare he? How can dare he? Yeah. Question a woman. <laughs> how dare he? Even though he, presumably he's been working on the case the entire time. No, he's her. not. He's been Side sat down side? with his foot up his ass because he's a man. Yeah. He ain't do nothing, Jane. Nothing. all the work. <laughs> she did everything in the paralegal. Did everything. Yeah. They lock him out of the office. Well, he kind of walks out or gets thrown out anyway. He's so thrown out. They shut the door in his face. Because that's how counsel works. <laughs> Disagree with a woman. Get out of here. Yeah. Even if you're supposed to be on the same team. Oh, they're not. Oh, my God. 
Just like, how do you do that? These women are on the same team. (laughs) Oh, no. So, yeah, we get that wonderful tidbit. And then, God, Jesus Christ, her paralegal friend scares me. The paralegal's weird. Looks weird, acts weird. Yeah. Can't wait to uh, not like this character. Yeah. And then, it, uh, and they, yeah, they she add a little glass ceiling there too in context. They don't say it directly, but like they're they're talking about her as if she's struggling to make it up the ladder or whatever in her career. Uh huh. But she, at least the actual character, was like top of her class in law school. So how is she like? Just got her own office. Like none of that makes any sense either. I'm going to guess the patriarchy. Oh, there you go. That answers that question. <laughs> That's my guess. There you go. Uh, down with the patriarchy. That was just so bizarre. It's, like, uh, it's such a... Um, it's such a... Ta- like, it's victim It's victim of porn. Exactly. And remember, every, every woman has been hard done by. Yeah, every woman is angry and scared. <laughs> Those are like the baseline emotions of being a woman. <laughs> oh my god. Maybe for being a fucking woman like you. Yeah, maybe. Who <laughs> creates your own fucking enemies in your head. Oh god. You, you, you make yourself scared of every man. Ugh. <sighs> You think every man wants to rape you? You think that's all men think about? I, I can be mind, honest with you, Jane. It doesn't cross my mind. In her mind. But she's stronger than everyone, so I don't I don't get it. Uh yeah, I'm a victim, but better than you. Yeah. <laughs> that is the that is the plight of the white Karen. How does that work? Um you be, it's like it's like the Rainbow Mafia. <laughs> it's like the Rainbow Mafia, Jane. They are the people that have the power. Mm-hmm. And they're screaming down at people below them that they're oppressed yeah. and a minority. Oh, there you go. There you go. It's kind of the same thing here. I'm a woman. Uh, men are, are, are just awful. Mm-hmm. Uh, and uh, I've been oppressed in my career because I'm a woman, uh, but yeah. I'm better than you at everything. Right. It doesn't make any sense. <sighs> Start your own fucking But here we go. Every single scene. So she turns to the camera and she goes, oh, by the way, I'm the Hulk. Uh, my friend knows. Um, and what? <laughs> let me just, let me just, let's go back a few months and see oh, how it all happens. Flashback. So this flashback is, uh, by the way, folks, this flashback is a complete waste of time. Yeah. She learns nothing. Absolutely nothing. From the island whatsoever. Uh, and basically it's there to say, this Hulk is better than your, my Hulk's better than your Hulk. Exactly. He helps her in no way. He contributes to her growth in not one single bit. She insults well, him the entire time. She's not time. open to it, though. She's never open to no, it. No, she wants to go home the whole time. She's just like, I can do it already. Mm. She literally says it. So then wh- why are we here? Just to suffer. <laughs> Press F in the chat. Pay respects. <laughs> That's it. No point. No. So we get the car scene that I did a video on the other day. Yeah. <laughs> where she's um, virgin shaming Captain America. Ugh. There's only one Captain America. When I say Captain America, it's Steve exactly. Rogers. We all know. There is. there is. So she's virgin shaming him for some reason, even though there's no evidence to suggest that Steve is actually a virgin. When he's going around all these places during the war. Yeah. You know, doing these shows with all the dancing girls and all the, you know, all the women who... Mm-hmm. There's, you know, good chance that him and one of the girls, you know... But even if they... Course. Even if he hmm? didn't, it, to me, like, my whole issue with it was... Oh, it doesn't matter if he didn't... With, 
But it's contrasted against her being a slut, slut throughout the entire show, uh, the entire series. This is a series, by the way, folks, that created a fake Tinder profile. Yes. Which is aimed at men mm. on a show that they say is for women by women through the lens of a woman mm -hmm. who's a slut. Yeah. But they they put a, a advert on Tinder for dudes. To call, hey, <laughs> do you want? Hey, guys, guys that are looking to fucking get balls deep in clunge. <laughs> sorry, Jane. I'm so sorry. <laughs> But dudes are looking to go balls deep into some fucking easy fucking clunge. Do you wanna do you wanna take half an hour out of your time <laughs> to watch a paralegal comedy about no, they want to fuck her. <laughs> Not watch her on the TV paralegal comedy show. <laughs> it's so absurd. And that's their advertising. It that's is. their advertising. That's their advertising. That's and they want to the the virgin shame Steve Rogers. Jesus Christ, if I was Steve Rogers, I'd fucking stay a virgin with this these fucking women around me. <laughs> He's God knows word. what he'll pick up. Right. No kidding. Yeah, it'll be Steve Rogers visits the clinic the day after. <laughs> Sorry to say, Steve, but yeah, you're crabs. But... With what we see her doing in this show, yeah. Oh, oh that's movie. all up and coming. I can't wait <laughs> for that episode. It'll probably be next week. They'll just get straight into the slottery. Yeah. Uh, why are you like slut shaming independent women who are. No, these aren't independent women. These yeah. are women of a particular age in their 30s whose biological clock is running out. <laughs> and they think that they can uh, satiate that desire by just buying dudes who have no. No plan whatsoever to settle down no. and have a relationship with them. They just want a one night stand and they just want to get out of fucking town. That's it. So, so don't, don't, don't fucking uh, say them. Independent women. Yeah. <laughs> this is an independent woman that don't need no man that needs a man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Uh, yeah, so we have the car scene where she's, you know, yeah, and then the ship comes down and she's not paying attention to the road. She driver. wrecks the car. Sorry, Jane. <laughs> I didn't notice that. <laughs> I was making jokes about this. They are just jokes. Holy shit. The ankle bite is just like, why don't you just say you fucking hate women? Why don't you just say it? Just say it. Listen. I've been going for more like than a women, few times. I can take the piss out of them, you know? <laughs> the, um, oh my God, the way that Jen gets, it's so low rent. Yeah. It's just like so lazy now. It's like, we don't really want to go into origin stories because we really just want to get to the slattery mm -hmm. um, or, or whatever it may be. And, you know, we just want to get to the misandry. We just want to get to the male hatred. Yeah. Uh, so they just have these now then have these really low rent. Oh, I'm a, I'm a hero now. I got my hero powers immediately. Hey, that's it. So she crashes the car. Mm -hmm. She gets out the car. She cuts herself getting out the car, and then she pulls Bruce out the car. That that happened. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Uh, and Bruce, the reason why Bruce is in human form is because he's constructed an inhibitor. Yeah. Which prevents him from changing into the Hulk. Mm -hmm. So that's why he didn't immediately Hulk out when this happened. Uh, and he has all the vulnerabilities of human. So he's now bleeding and he drips his blood onto her. I was going to uh. say gash. But yeah. let's use a different word based off the fact that this series is probably going to use that word quite a bit. <laughs> um, her her uh, cut. Yeah, this is the stupidest change. When I heard about this, I was just like, oh my God, why? Her How it actually happens is so much more dramatic, so much more powerful and emotional. It's, what is this? But you can't have a man give power to a woman. No, now. you can't have him be a Because hero. we have these intersectional brain dead 
window licking mentally ill feminists writing these shows now it's so stupid though yes it is yes it is so stupid it could have been so much better so she hulks out and wanders off into the wood she wakes up at night hey jane do you know what i love what's that i love (laughs) Whenever a Karen comes into contact with a man and immediately thinks they're going to rape her. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Even if they're just saying, hey. Even if they're just saying, hey, hello, are you? are you all right? Hey, woman who looks like she's just been through the mill, are you okay? <laughs> are you all right? No. We're just trying to see if you're, we're just trying to be friendly. No, let's hulk out and just beat you all up. Yeah. They're probably dead. You know that. She killed them. <laughs> So she goes to, uh, she she comes out of the wood and she's by some, you know, roadhouse bar. Yeah, for some reason. Oh, God. And a diverse group of friends find her. Yeah, so she she goes into the bathroom to to clean up. And then Priscilla, Queen of the Desert, and her friends come in? Yeah. I mean, oh, no. (laughs) I just remembered what they said. They, them? (laughs) Well, yeah, they said, is she okay? And then somebody said, well, maybe he? And then somebody said, they? Yeah. (laughs) They have to do the, all the pronoun stuff is in there. Followed by the sexual harassment. Yeah. All that. Sorry, that was just a, an internal cry from my body to stop the pain. <laughs> just stop this fucking pain. Oh, God. Oh, God. So, yeah, now that they got the pronouns, he, is, she, is she, is it a he <laughs> that identifies a he? Or maybe they identify as a them. Yeah. Now that we've got that out, and I just want to drag the, all of these women into a bonfire and set them alight. <laughs> It'll be a laugh. Oh, my God. Oh, you do have your trans representation too. Was one? Yeah, I think one of them was. There's a guy. A yeah. yeah. Mm. Do you know how I could tell? How? It sounded like a guy. <laughs> oh, the <I'm> dawn. <laughs> hey, <who's she? laughs> so they dress her up like a whore. <laughs> Literally, like a streetwalker. Yes. <laughs> now, if I was those dudes coming out half cut and I saw that, <laughs> I'd be thinking, "Oh, look, <laughs> we got a we got a woman of the night." Yeah. So they literally dress her up like a, a whore, mm-hmm. and then and then she goes back outside. Yeah. I mean, no. By the way, nobody acts like this, and this isn't funny. No. But I think this is one of the the scenes that they want to think was comedy. I think so, but it it was just bizarre. It was just weird. I mean, all I'm saying is because they they if, see if I was a black woman and I watched that, I'd be like, <laughs> really, they really. See that, they see that she's injured, and they just give her a makeover. They don't. Yes, yes. Call an yes. ambulance, drive her home. It's just like <laughs> <laughs> she's injured, and the way that they they fucking decide to deal with her injuries to put makeup on her. <laughs> they do. And a, and a fuzzy whore coat. <laughs> they say, you get your ass back out there, girl. <laughs> they probably thought she was a fucking prostitute got beaten up by a pimp. <laughs> Let's just touch it up then, Jen. Back on the corner with you. Yeah, back on the corner. <laughs> you got making that money. Dude's come out. Well, hello there. <laughs> Are you free? <laughs> So uh, some guys come out. Three guys come out. Yeah. First one seemed quite nice. I mean, <laughs> it was just like he didn't come across as like creepy. I mean, the white guys behind him look creepy because that's what white guys gotta do. <laughs> yeah. This guy's just kind of like, "Hi, you all right? You know, you can hear." And she just like walks away immediately because every, they're clearly going to rape her. Yeah, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> 
right there next to the bar. Right there. <laughs> just outside the door of the bar. <laughs> this independent, strong, intelligent woman mm -hmm. decides to leave the right. safety of the lit area <laughs> to wander back towards the dark woods. It's insane. Who wrote this trash? Uh, Jessica Gow. She needs help. Oh, yeah. Like, this is I, I, I think probably 90% of the women that worked on this need help. <laughs> and are working through some do. things. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 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 they got issues, you know, and I'm fine. Yeah. So, uh, she uh when they start talking to her, no, no, nobody laid a finger on her no nobody laid a finger on her and she uh hulked out to jen because how dare you how dare you and then hit one of them yeah or screamed and hit one of them who's probably uh, two of them who's probably dead she attacks them <laughs> so they did nothing she assaulted them. Mm -hmm. Never brought up again. Not arrested. Never. This is what should happen to men that speak to women. Yeah. They deserve to be beaten up. Okay? It's insane. What's no insane is we've been talking for half an hour and we're <laughs> seven minutes into the fucking show. There is so much to we got to I mean we I mean you know there's oh, so yeah. much but I can't be fucked <laughs> you know I'm going to cut scenes I don't care this is shit yeah yeah this is this is puke on the plate it's so bad oh my god so then Jen wakes up in a bed in a tropical retreat. Mm -hmm. It's uh, Bruce's uh, tropical hideaway. Yeah, this is the other trailer we saw. Yeah, just slightly, just slightly longer and just <laughs> more misandry added, you know, yeah. <laughs> or misandry, whichever way people want to pronounce. Different places, different people. Just <laughs> uh, so she finds Bruce down in his underground lab, and he's now Professor Hulk. But they've decided to call him Smart Hulk. Yeah, I thought that was weird. Why don't you just call him Professor Hulk? I don't, I don't know. Uh, was it because uh, she made a jab at him being smart? And then he was like, I just said I didn't give myself that name. But she still took the piss. Yeah, she did keep... As if it was him that named himself Smart Hulk. Yeah. But he clearly said... You know, they, I, they they call me Smart Hulk. I didn't I didn't give myself this name. Right. Yeah, the whole thing. It's just like manufactured ways to snap at people. Yeah. Uh so he talks about uh the fact that you know the inhibitor's broken, so um he used her blood to heal himself. Yeah. <laughs> to heal himself. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, uh, I almost we cut it off at that point. <laughs> just like, you know what? Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Just, I'll just say to us, look, I tried. <laughs> I tried. But I couldn't I couldn't get through. Oh. I'd be like, Jane, I I understand. <laughs> I understand. Oh. And then we probably would have had a cry together. Yeah. Or something, because I fucking wanted to cry after this shit. Um, yeah, because of course, you know, we got to deconstruct once again mm -hmm. the heroes uh, to 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 try and elevate the bitches, yeah, the Karens, yeah. Uh, so you know, they do some techno talk for a bit. Nobody cares, and then he destroys the rest of her blood because he says it's too dangerous. Mm -hmm. She's too powerful, and they, and they and they also tease another Hulk. Mm -hmm. The paralegal, uh, maybe? I don't know. Oh, God, I don't. <laughs> Probably Jen again. <laughs> Could be. Does she, 
she can have, you know, she's just multi Hulk now. Yeah. I changed from Jen to the Hulk to the to the really obnoxious Hulk. Yeah. Ultra Hulk. Oh, yeah. The Incredible Hulk. The fucking obnoxious Hulk. There you go. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. So um, she's like, oh, I need something. Oh, she's hungry. She needs to eat. She's a fucking yeah. woman. That's what women write about in fucking comics mm. nowadays. Eating, yeah. eating, always fucking eating. <laughs> Those pancakes did look good. <sighs> yeah, I'm quite hungry. I've just woken up. <laughs> Gonna have a bowl of fruit and fiber after that. Um, so she's eating pancakes, and he's just like, you, you got to embark on a big journey now. It's a 10 year journey. That's when he whacks down the folder. Mm hmm. Then he sticks her in the chamber where he's going to try and, you know, instigate the Hulk coming out. Yeah. And, uh, you know, it's it's driven by fear and, you know, anger. anger. And she's like, those are the best line of emotions for anyone. (laughs) I got got, got news for you. No, it's not. They're not. It's not. Our entire existence isn't being angry and scared. What is? If that is your it life, is you you need counseling. <laughs> yeah. This is therapist. this is Cali. This is this is fucking <laughs> Californian fucking um, wine mom yeah. who's never worked in her life, has had all her money provided to her from her spouse, mm-hmm. whinging. Yeah, exactly. Oh my god, my life's so hard. Oh. I just like sit by the pool all day and do absolutely fuck all. And then when my husband comes home, who like makes all the money, I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> Why are you here? You're making noise. Oh my god. Ugh, trauma. The trauma. <laughs> in their heads, it's like Shakespeare. In their heads, it's probably like, oh. Woe is me, for I am undone! (laughs) But for us, it's just like, oh my god! That is so true. That is so So, true. (laughs) I think it is in their minds that they're the hero of their own story, you know? That's it. That's it. Uh, Ah, Andre. (laughs) Um, To be or not to be. Please, not to be. That would be great. That would be awesome. So she just, she turns into the Hulk and she stops the thing. We saw it. She opens the door. She starts screaming. And then he's like, Jen, Jen. And she's like, what? He's like, what? Well, you're Jen? Yeah. And she's like, yeah. Because mm-hmm. this was meant to take 15 years to sort out her Hulkness. Yeah. I don't know why 15 years, because it didn't take him 15 years. But okay. Um, but she's already done it. Yeah. Because she's amazing. Amazing. She's amazing. <laughs> she automatically has her own personality on the whole. My personality personality is really loose. Yeah, you but... yeah, you're being very generous. <laughs> <laughs> Gave a little bit too much credit there, did I? <laughs> uh so yeah, she's got in in Hulk form. By the way, the CJ is fucking abysmal. It's so and anyone that says the CGI is better than it is in the trailers is a fucking liar. <laughs> I thought it was worse in most places. It was it was better than I think the first time they came out, which was just I don't even know what that was, but it still makes her look morphed. Like it, it doesn't doesn't look remotely natural no, or normal. Right. <sighs> he looked okay. He looked, and Rock I think Hulk looked if they okay. Used different CGI on, on each character. Well, apart, well, he looked okay apart from when they tried to do the hug, and neither of them could get anywhere six foot near to the other, <laughs> and they're both like uh, into fresh air. Yeah, that was fucking terrible. Anyway, was, so you know, that was weird. That was a weird contrast too. Mm. The whole thing's a weird contrast. <laughs> So uh, yeah, Hulk's a bit sad because uh, because Jen can do everything immediately. Yeah. So uh, now uh, he's trying to teach her like breathing techniques and shit, mm. and she's just pr- prattling around. So he goes, "Fuck it, you know. We'll, do, we'll you've worked hard. We'll do. We'll come back in the morning or whatever." 
But she's being Possibly. a brat the whole time. And it's like you're a 30 yes. something year old woman, a professional. Why are you acting like this? Um, because these women are children. Yeah. It comes across here. You know, if, you, if they are adult children. Yeah. You know, they're oh my god, these wussy boozy woozy goosey goosey goochie wooshies. <laughs> they're them. It's so that's immature. who they are, and that's how they write. Mm-hmm. They're like the fucking Gail Simones, you know? Yeah. Fucking retarded. Yeah. Uh, but think they're uh, intelligent and, and you know, clever. Ugh. But then they go, oh, my God, joke's on you, because I was actually acting uh, as meant to be a- acting retarded. No. It's that. It's that kind of thing. No, no you, 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 just, you just walked into the trap. <laughs> it's a complete self-insert. I can't wait for if this is written by a different writer every episode, and I think it is, mm-hmm. with Jessica Gao being the like main writer, you know, mm-hmm. head writer, staff writer, that's what they call them, don't they? Mm-hmm. Uh holy shit, expect like six different fucking crazy personalities. Oh my God. <laughs> or <laughs> across the six episodes. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a wild oh, ride. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> So this is where he wakes her up with a horn and she turns into a Hulk and then they have that incredibly funny scene which isn't remotely funny. At all. Then uh, he uh, they do some, I don't know, weird like Tai Chi which doesn't even look like anything Tai Chi related. It looks stupid. I don't know what that is. Yeah. Whatever. Mm-hmm. That's when we get the spandex is your best friend. Not funny. No. That's when we get he, th- he just chucks a boulder and then she just chucks a boulder and it goes further because she's better. Yeah. So he like picks up a bolt and just throws it into like fucking into uh, the atmosphere and then it lands and destroys Fiji. Yeah. Because <laughs> it lands with the impact of 10 nuclear bombs. Yeah. But don't worry about that. Because he's, he's of course, he's, he, he, <laughs> he's insecure Ugh. and has to prove himself. Mm hmm. Do you know who always gets the last word in these streams with Jane and me? <laughs> I'll give you a clue. It's not me. <laughs> Jane always gets the final goodbye. That's the way it is. That's the way we like it. I like it. Yeah. It just naturally and organically happened. <laughs> and I didn't feel insecure to think, hmm, <laughs> Jane, Jane keeps getting these final goodbyes in. This is this is on my channel. I should get it. No. You know who thinks like that? A dumb fuck. Yeah. A dumb, stupid, insecure writer. Exactly. Because you're just projecting your own insecurity onto these characters. That's it. That's what's happening in the show. Yeah. And the entire video right now. Yeah. Oh, this is what's happening <laughs> in the world right now with a lot of things. So then we get like they do the jump and they do the landing, and then she just like gets up and starts going. Rrr, 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 rrr. Yeah, that was my face the entire time. <laughs> Why? She's not hulking out. She's herself. You're, you're, yeah, you're, you're already in the hole with your own persona. Why are you doing? Uh, is it because, oh, once again, you're mocking like the superhero landing what? type? Exactly. Heroes are stupid. Yeah. Heroes are stupid, doopy, silly, billy willies. Why don't they just like sit down and talk and eat <laughs> like I write about every week? And then there's one panel where they punch one thing, then they can get back to the talking and the eating. Oh my god. I wonder why I gave up buying mainstream cars. When she does insult superheroes, there's a line in there. Yeah, she's like, I don't want to be a hero. Yeah. I'm a superhero. I'm a lawyer. <laughs> and there's so much better job. <laughs> lawyer. <You're> a... <laughs> hey, Nick Ricada. Shh. Don't listen to this <laughs> Lawyers are the scum of the earth. <laughs> Take advantage of, of, of hardship. You lie. 
in an effort. And then he just pushes her off a cliff because she's and then she's like Ugh. He bounces right back though. She just goes, Wait. <laughs> she didn't even hit the ground. No. <laughs> she just went, wait. He they don't even give him that. No. No, they give him nothing. In actual fact. I mean, when the fight starts, I don't even know why the fucking fight starts. No. To be perfect. This, yeah, th then we get the drunk bit. Hey, look, look, all I'm doing is showing you some negatives of the Hulk. Uh, let me show you some positives. Um, we metabolize alcohol that we can drink as much as we want and not get drunk. I'm just like, that's fucking awful. Yeah. I'd rather yeah. have cups of tea if that was going to be the case. And then they just drink it all. Yeah, then they just drink tons of alcohol, don't get drunk, and then wake up. she wakes up with a hangover. Mm. I don't know that that's how that works. Apparently so, because <laughs> that's what they did. That's a joke. <clears throat> that's the joke. The joke is she's a wine mon. <laughs> the, yeah, that's the joke. The joke is you drink alcohol, don't get drunk, but you get a hangover. That's yeah, the joke. That is the joke. I'm laughing. I'm not laughing at that. <laughs> I'm laughing at the fact that that was appalling an attempt at a joke. Yeah. But there, like I said, my my face through the whole episode is this. Mm -hmm. Not once did it deviate. And just in case, you know, anyone, you know, are we, yeah, but you came in here and you just... You're wanting to hate this anyway. So I guarantee you there was nothing to even smirk about. Honest to God. There's nothing funny in no. this. And I I actually, when they started the the opening scene and they heard she doing her little 30 second closing or whatever. Yeah. I had a little bit of I was like, okay, well, this might actually be a lawyer show. It might actually be good. And then it wasn't. It went immediately downhill after that. I know I'm going to jump, just jump slightly, mm -hmm. but I need to remember the court scene in this episode. Oh, God. Exactly. Oh, God. <laughs> Did you remember the guy's closing? Absolutely uh, pathetic. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely yeah. My, pathetic. My client may or may not have negligently killed people. <laughs> Like, no, you guys really don't know how to write. <laughs> I would have just stood up and gone, we don't need to close. Good. He just he just closed for us. <laughs> oh boy. So um I don't know. They talked I can't be honest, I kind of zoned Nothing out. Really Nothing really happened on the beach. Yeah, they just talked about something I don't know, not much. Basically, she's better than him. Yeah, that's it. That's the whole uh, montage. Yeah, and she she um she just wants to go back home, so she goes to his jeep. Mm -hmm. Just like I'm out of here. Yeah, I don't I don't want to be a hero. He tries to stop her. Yeah, he tried. Oh yeah, by the way, the Hulk now gets uh pushed back <laughs> fifty yards by a, a little jeep. I was like, what? That smooth starts from a stationary start as well. Never mind it's, even uh, getting momentum. Yeah. I'm like, uh, who do what now? What? The Hulk is, is, <laughs> fuck off. What? He could have thrown that Jeep and her. I, I, it just wouldn't budge. It uh, just wouldn't budge. Speechless. But yeah, she she just starts the jeep and pushes it into drive, and then it yeah. just goes. Just fly. Oh, and by the way, mm -hmm. the the trailer edited it was edited. So when she did her boosh, mm -hmm. we saw the Hulk go flying back into the rocks. Mm. That was the jeep. Oh, when she did the claps, nothing happened. He was just like ah with his ears yeah so they intentionally manipulated the trailer throughout to just be like she's like totally better rah, 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 rah. of course of course i know i know <laughs> i would also turn my back on the show <laughs> 
So yeah, she, so he goes flying into the rocks, and then she's like, "Bruce!" And then he, uh, she starts strong. They start fighting. Or mm. yeah, for some reason. Yeah, fight breaks up. I don't know. Because we gotta, we gotta get our quota of fight in. Yeah, it's an action scene. <laughs> but he's he's fighting her because he's mad that she doesn't want to be a hero and listen to him. Is this more insecurity projection? I think so, yeah. All I know is I don't care. He's an insecure male who's physically attacking her because of it. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, that's their wet dream. <laughs> exactly. That's their bean flicking moment right there. Yeah. So yeah, that's that's uh, when she starts doing the clapping business, and it's just hurting his ears. He's uh, on the ground, ball in a ball. And that, yeah, she throws a just like a a hen cage or something at his head, and so his silly. glasses get broke. So now his glasses are broken. <laughs> he's mad. So they start throwing each other around the place and punching each other, and then they smash into his bar, and he's like, "Oh my bar." <laughs> And she's like, I'm sorry. He's like, you're going to help me fix it. And I'm just like, what is the fucking point of any of this? What is happening? Oops, sorry. <laughs> I'm fucking killing Belle over here. <laughs> Knocking my water bottle. I'm sorry. <laughs> Daddy, didn't, Daddy didn't mean to startle you. You okay? Yeah, good girl. You know. <laughs> She she knows when the rage isn't at her. You know? Yeah. Not that the rage is in you when you goofy. No, oh, she's purring. <laughs> it's all good. She's like, I understand. This is a, <laughs> this is a completely shit show. <laughs> so he's just like, well, I don't mind if you go back to being a lawyer. Yeah. And then she turns to the camera and goes, I oh, know, I respect that. And then she turns to the camera and goes, No, he doesn't. Can't even give him that either. Oh, no, <laughs> nothing. Not he an just inch. Destroyed his fucking island. Then they do the absolutely in unbelievably bad CGI hug. Yeah. And then she holds the hug even after the, he's pulled away because <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know, obviously, because she's just got this green screen and you know, <laughs> no fucking idea when he's pulled away. <laughs> so they go back, she goes back, and then we go back to where we were at the beginning of the mm -hmm. episode. Hell. Yeah, <laughs> basically. And then we have the uh, the dude giving the closing argument. Oh, for his, my God. <laughs> my client may or may not have killed people. People might have negligently died. I mean, uh... yeah, it's all right. <laughs> it's fine. And then they're just like, Jen, now it's your time to do the closing. She goes up, you know, all 12 good men type of... Well, the guy, the guy says something first. I can't remember. He insults her. I oh, yeah, he insults her. He's like, I, I would have been better or it should have been me or something. Yeah, something like you that. You know, derogatory. Because women... <laughs> Been spending most of my life living in a mission tree <laughs> paradise. <laughs> oh. Oh, they, they it, it's this is what gets them off. This is so bad. They just get they get off on on, on just this absolute seething penis envy. It doesn't make them look better though. No. <laughs> It's a big red flag to stay the fuck away from those crazies. <laughs> uh, I'll stick to a normal woman. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Jeez. A woman that you can have a conversation with. A woman that's actually got proper and true intelligence. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Doesn't have to be perfect. Not Just asking normal. you to be perfect. Not crazy. I'll treat you, you know, well. <laughs> Yeah, I just, yeah. So crazy. Just don't be crazy. <laughs> don't be fucking mental. <laughs> somebody I can laugh with, somebody, you know, can watch a movie with. Could you watch a movie with these people? Oh, I, God. 
I would kill them. I would. <laughs> Either that or yourself. Jokes. No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. M yeah. More likely me, actually. <laughs> <clears throat> what was the last? <clears throat> excuse me. What was the last sentence I typed to you before we started this stream? Uh, be right there, shooting myself in the <laughs> face. <laughs> Oh. So Jen starts her, her terrible closing speech and mm -hmm. then smash oh. Jamelia Jamalia. I don't know who this person is. is no idea. Yeah. Comes bashing in through the wall and stuff falls down. And then she just stops and waits for a scene to happen. Yeah. <laughs> that was so weird. Literally just smashes in. Oh, you know, we've seen the thing in the trailer. Yeah. And then Jen and her paralegal are just like car behind and they just have a fucking old conversation. Yeah. And she's doing nothing. Nothing's happening. At all. And it's just like, oh, Jen, go do the, go Hulk out, do your thing. And then she's like, oh, my shoes. I, I love this outfit though. Because mm. oh, comedy, I yeah. guess. This is it? I suppose. I didn't laugh. No, I was confused. I was wondering why are they having this conversation while somebody just smashed through the courtroom and doing nothing? Yeah. I mean, the place so looks destroyed. People have been hurt. <laughs> this set looked cheap as fuck. <laughs> I ain't this is serious about this. This was one <laughs> fucking cheap set. Looked in, it's made out of balsa wood. They didn't put much into it, no. So, uh, you know, all the men are car carrying as well, obviously. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And then she just turns around, turns into the She-Hulk. Mm -hmm. We see one of the worst CGI <laughs> jump kicks in the history of planet Earth. It was so bad. And if the show wasn't so bad, I would have laughed at how bad that was. But it's literally like, you know, you go, oh! Yeah. It and then what she just did, yeah, punches I was like, it once. Bad wire work. I. <laughs> I think the whole thing. I. <laughs> then the whole She Hulk. By the way, they she doesn't refer to herself as She Hulk. No. She refers to herself as Hulk. Yeah. 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 Uh, punches uh, her once, and she just smashes into wall, and that's it. That's it. That's your fight. One punch. <laughs> That's the fight. That's the fight. And then uh, she turns back to Jen and is just like, I'm ready to give my closing arguments now. And it ends. And I'm just like, What's it? Ugh. Holy shit, I wasted my life. Ugh. I was just happy it was over. What was the, the end credit scene? They go back to Cap being a virgin and that whole conversation except it's happening at the bar. And he mentions that he actually did sleep with some girl when he was on his tour. So that was it. That was the scene. <laughs> don't know what it was for, what it was supposed to convey. I don't know. Oh, she throws an F bomb too at the end, but they cut it off like right after the F part. What the fuck? Yeah. Okay, I don't need to see that scene. No, it added nothing. So, we're going to do a new scoring system. Oh, God. <laughs> it's going to be from 0 to 10. Mm -hmm. uh, what would you give this uh, episode? <laughs> uh, God. So bad. I'm going to start out with a 1. Let me give them some opportunity. Um, <clears throat> to go up it, this, this this was trash. It was so bad. This was just a mitigated trash. I mean, I I, I thought this was going to be bad. I didn't realize how boring it was going to be. Right. Uh, this this is. I I have no idea what this is meant to do in terms of entertainment. There was no entertainment here unless you're a white Karen that hates men. That that's because the audience, I guess. All dudes who date you leave because you're a fucking horrible, obnoxious Karen. It's not oh, them, it's you. Exactly. 
And it just came, <laughs> she comes across as, again, unlikable. What it's a surprise. Arrogant, egotistical, self centered. Yeah. But she's the victim. Somehow. Doesn't want to listen to her cousin who's gone through this change. Can't have the dynamic of, of a female. And, and this is only Marvel, by the way, not in reality. Mm hmm. This is just Marvel's fucking intersectional feminist wank. Uh, couldn't even have her take the advice of somebody who'd been altered in this manner. Right. Even a family member. But because he's a male, he can have no influence on her being the bestest ever. No. Even though it would show her growing, maturing, coming to grips with what's happened to her like a day ago. It's... Yeah, literally a day ago. Nah, I'm good. I'm better than you. Bye. I will give this a my gut says one. It does. It's this it's in the, it's there's less nothing I mean, here. The insulting Hulk was the worst part of it. Because he's such a good character. And he's such an actual heroic person. And in the show, he's the better person. He's trying to help her. And at every step, he's being insulted. He only exists for the name. Yes. And to validate her superiority. Yes. And it's just like, what? That's, it's a complete waste of his character. But it's an insult. An insult of his character. And I, I, I cannot respect that. I, I honestly, I am racking my brain to give this extra points for something and i can't what? think of a single thing they didn't give us any lawyer scenes because they can't write them apparently they can't write the lawyer scenes yet they, they actually admit to that yeah. so we're just going to get karen speak i guess mm -hmm. um next week she's probably just going to get fucking genital herpes uh <laughs> Or something, I don't know. That's what the show seems to be about for these women. I mean, that's mm -hmm. that's the way they seem to be pushing the show. That's it. That's the direction. <clears throat> uh, I, yeah. I mean, one, it's tr it, it was utter trash. It was absolute trash, and it was also insulting to her character. Like for everything we talked about before, they they stripped away her humanity and her vulnerability. So there's nothing. Can't have left. a vulnerable woman. Yeah, can't have it. Can't have a humane, balanced, emotionally woman. No. Shit. Oh, God, I'm so grateful this is only six episodes and a half hour long. Because <laughs> put, it, put it this way. Um, if I wasn't doing these videos with you to entertain <laughs> you, uh, I'd, I'd be out. Oh, yeah. I'd be out. I'd be watching this and be like, fuck off. <laughs> you know? Yeah. There's there's nothing to see here. It, it's like Ms. Marvel when Drinker and I did it. We're just like, should we do should we come back for part two? Yeah, let's do part two. We'll do it this Friday. None of us none of us contacted. I still haven't other. finished it. <laughs> no, we didn't get past episode one. That was it. Yeah. No reason to. Same no. here. I mean, I would say Ms. Marvel's first episode was better than this. Oh yeah, it was. It was better than it was better than this. I mean, the the at least the the actress that played Ms. Marvel had this bit of spark to her. Mm -hmm. The the uh, direction was way better. Mm -hmm. This was so flat. Throughout. The direction there was there was no, you know, it's just flat, flat, yeah. flat, flat. Nothing, nothing dynamic with the scenes. Nothing, nothing interesting visually. The whole thing flat as a fucking flat <laughs> Tatiana Maslany's <laughs> chest. That, that's for the that's for the ankle biters to get some misogyny talk. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> <laughs> Jane, is there anything you'd like to plug before we finish? Uh, yeah, I recently dropped a video about Ezra Miller's non-apology. Mm. Basically how they're, I guess, are trying to rehabilitate him ahead of the Flash release. So, <laughs> <laughs> And it seems to be working with, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got complex mental health issues. <laughs> right. Where are the kids, though? That's my question. Where are the children you're hiding? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's
All I want to know. <sighs> Don't talk about that. I know. <laughs> uh, thank you so much. I'll no. see you next Hulk time, next Hulk channel. Yes, yes. For episode two, where Jessica Gao gets down to <laughs> what this show's really about. Oh. Drinking wine and, and dating men. Dating using Lucifer. <laughs> Dating, yeah. whoring around. Whoring right. around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, until then, you take care. Bye for now. Bye. See, she got the final word. <laughs> I got the final word. Shit. <laughs>